Welcome back to the channel, guys. Before we get into this video, I wanted to let you know we are giving away this 2001 Z06 Corvette, 17,000 miles. You guys know I love Corvettes. We found the perfect one for you. It's also coming with a brand new Pro Charger kit that just got installed, 18 inch CCW wheels, brand new tires, and $10,000 cash to the lucky winner that wins this car. All you have to do is go to 1320video.com, links in the description. Every dollar you spend is a chance to win this car. But I don't want to mess with it because he forgets. This is a light up. got a familiar face here. We saw you here in Dallas a couple months ago for the cash days. Out yes. here at Yellow Belly for the baddest small tire race in America. Yes. Uh, so tell me the combo on the truck again. Um, it's a uh, 6.7 6 sleeve down to a 5.9. And it's got a GT55 88 uh, turbo and it's a 4R, Ford 4R transmission. What's so. the reason for the smaller displacement? Um, Just because you need For sleeve. strength. Gotcha. Uh, so it was, it's a happy medium without, you know, it's, it's a budget build in a sense. It's not super, it's not a deck plate, it's not a big deck plate 6.7 six, six, motor, so something like that. Um, and it was a good starting point for me. So um, the, the way you can strengthen it without the deck plate is is sleeve it down to the 5.9. So that's where you get the strength out of it. Gotcha. And it's still like stock ECM, no trans brake, um, stock uh, wow. frame from front, as you can see from front, all the oh, yeah. back of the cab. Um, I have some fiberglass on it, but it's still 4,600 pounds. So, it's, it, it's stock still axles. plenty of steel in here. Oh yeah, stock axles, stock steering, uh, it's not even a rack and pinion, uh, stock differentials, uh, drive shafts, wow. transfer case. stock transfer case. How much do you spray on this thing? So tonight we may actually spray more than we ever have before, believe it or not. Because you got a good track? Yes, because we got a decent track. So um, we'll, we'll spray about four kits, but it's not a lot. It's kind of spread out more than anything. So for the diesel side of things, it's not a ton. Um, for maybe the gasser side, it might be a little bit more. It's probably a, a total of about 500 horsepower worth. Okay. Still a decent amount. Just a diesel. How much power do you think you'll be at if you're able to spray all four kits? Let's say just under 2,000. I'd say probably 1,950. Um, but Chris, my tuner, will be uh, doing his calculator thing yeah. and be like, no, that was like 2,100 horsepower. <laughs> you need to slow down. But, yeah. And that truck source diesel is the one who built it. I uh, got their sticker on the back. And the Nathaniel at Truck Source Diesel is amazing. He did a lot of the fabrication. Josh and I have a bunch of hours in it too. We did it all like the Lexan and a lot of the cutting and, and the panels here and there. But uh, this is, uh, I definitely want to give a shout out to Truck Source Diesel for sure. Oh, yeah. uh, this is, oh, yeah. this is going to be an amazing race. Uh, I'm really looking forward to it. It's our first time filming at, filming at Yellow Belly. It's going to be interesting. Well, good luck this weekend, man. Hopefully, we'll see you going around again. Thank you. And thank you for the interview. For sure. Who did you draw first round? Oh boy, Brent Self. Oh you, oh you are racing Brent. I am. Oh boy, that's a. Uh, that's yeah. gonna be an interesting one. That's gonna be interesting. <laughs> Get her turned up. Um, I do a little bit, but I'm not. I don't want to do anything stupid like I did before. I, did, I jumped a couple steps. I just did one little step this time. So it's not anything crazy. We'll go. This is kind of our test pass, an expensive test pass because we get the buy back in. So. Oh, that's right. This is the first round. Yeah, we got buy back next still, round. Yeah. So I'm gonna do. Um, when we buy back in, I'm gonna do tailgate class as well. Oh, so I think sweet. I fit there a little better anyway. We'll see. Perfect. All right, good luck on the first hit. Thank you.
one to win that race. Throwing the chute sideways back in the throttle and crossing the finish line first. The truck wasn't far behind him though. It's anybody's game on this track. Yellow Belly is wild. How was your view of that race? That, that was, was actually pretty scary at one point because he got off and I'm, you know, I can see him. And I'm like, oh boy, he's gonna have to pedal. And then he pedals, but then the, his front end comes around and points right at me. Oh yeah. Oh my goodness. Hey, now what you know how happening? it feels. Oh yes, yes I do. That's true. That's very good point. He was he was he threw the chute and got back in the throttle right. once it came out. That was wild. Yeah, that was wild. I it think that's straight. probably right when it straightened out when it was headed towards you. Is that yes. chute really yes. helped him out? And I was trying to get into the fourth kit for the first time too. And when that happened, I was like, that's Whoa, a confidence. Yeah, yeah, that's not gonna help. In second round drivers meeting, you can buy in again. And we're gonna buy into uh, the tailgate class to see how we do there. Perfect. So, and actually, I'm gonna put the limiter back up, similar to the smoke show in Dallas this time, this <laughs> go round, because nice. I could have left harder. So I'm gonna do that. I like so it. So hopefully, leave harder. I've gone a lot faster than that. Yeah, I didn't spin, so that's so. good. All right, driver's meeting is about to start, so yep. we'll we're see you up. in the truck class here shortly. Yes. Look. Awesome. Thank you. Just a drag truck, you can still use it for a little bit of off roading. <laughs> well, it took all of it, uh, it actually did. Nice, that was pretty close. It can go up a little more than that, but um, we may stick to that because it really worked. So, we'll just see who we draw and then we'll go from there. But that was that uh, oh man, that was adrenaline rush. That was great, that was pretty, cool. pretty nice and straight, too. It was, I'm happy about that. Nice so. pass, awesome work. Thank you, thank you. Oh, what do we got here? The two diesels running each other, is that what I'm seeing? Unfortunately. 
officially the Camo Diesel going home. They got their rematch. The silver truck is 2-on-1 now. While we've got a second, I wanted to remind you to check out our merch store, 1320video.com. The link is in the description below. And if you haven't already, check out our 1320 Street Shine. We have some of the best car care products on the market. We spent a lot of time developing the formulas just for you guys. I replaced all of my car care cleaning products with 1320 Street Shine. I like them so much, and I know you will too. Wow. Yeah. Of all the ways to go out in the tailgate class, that was probably the coolest. What, did it look cool? It did. Okay, good. That yeah, was like it went a way, half yeah. truck. I mean, both of you were just like, yeah. it was crazy to see. Yeah, it spun really bad. Did it? Yeah, I'm kind of going uh. way out of the groove, and, and I couldn't get into the fourth kit because of that, but it was a good race. That Made for a good damn race. good race. Yeah. Yeah, we had some good. badass passes this weekend, yeah, man. Thank you. Yeah, no, nice work. Fun. Hopefully we'll thank see you again guys. soon. Yes, sure. Absolutely. One hell of a race, the closest race of the weekend here at Yellow Belly. I mean, I know they didn't want to go out in that race, but what better way to do it than against their friend, a fellow Disa racer? Insane. That's going to do it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll catch you next time.